right way to start the day with some dirty green water in my belly hole. Okay, feeling good about this one. Today's gonna be a good day. I almost just walked into that fight. Today is the Orlando Show day. Just woke up getting coffee from the bus in our Starbucks mugs, and we are now currently heading to another Starbucks to get more coffee and also some, some breakfast because I'm addicted to cheese danishes. And no, not this cheesy danish. <laughs> Different cheese danishes. <laughs> the ones that I can eat. Because if I ate you, then I go to jail. Really excited about today's show. Yeah, watch out for those bushes because it's just in the coolest venue ever. I'm really excited to go back there today and have fun with all my friends. You guys coming? I hope so. Anyway. Oh, the best part of waking up. I don't have folders. Well, that hurt. That took a big old blow to our happy fun factor meter. We were about to get some more dirty beans. But also cheese danishes. Which is weird because that place was open yesterday and that's not open today. They knew. They knew when I needed them most and they decided to go away. Also, it's windy here. But like most places over here, the wind is warm. It's strange. It's a creepy phenomenon they're not used to. We'll get ready for sunshine. <sighs> it's so nice and being hugged by everything. Chris is a person. The Starbucks America, Starbucks everywhere. Oh, I'm gonna get so cheesy. Yum. Sean? Sean? Sean. That's the American way to spell Sean. That's not my name. Get in your head. We made it to the venue. I mean, it is awesome. Not only really, did it look cool from the outside, but it looks cool from the inside. And there's a bunch of posters all the way down along, like the whole entire hallway. And it has a bunch of really great artists down front here. Hey, Tucker, it's 41. They played here. Well, back in 2004, my Michelle Branch. <laughs> There's four some 41 pictures. Nickelback, Story of the Year, John Legend, Nelly Furtado, Ron White, Nelly Furtado again, Kenny G, Diana Ross, Keith Urban, Lil John. <laughs> that was a uh, pre-Shots, Shots, um, forget the rest of the lyrics. Oh, that's a Shots, 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 Shots. That was in the lyrics. Uh, we fucking, Andrew WK came here, Barry Hard, I bet. Matchbox 20, Willie Nelson, Alanis Morissette. This, this is a cool one. Slayer played here. Oh, dude. I'm gonna play in the same place as Slayer and Megadeth. Seal played here? Dude, Seal gave a kiss from a rose from here. Oh, wait, no, they have Louis C.K. on the wall as well, so I guess it's not all musicians that got pictures here. 99% of an anthrax played here. <laughs> I love anthrax. The thing that's cool about this is the, the difference and the eclectic mix of different musicians that have played here. But also, there's a picture of Twilight right here and somebody did this. Wow. So we just got taken to a really cool room called the John Lennon Room. Look at all this stuff. This shit is awesome. But the coolest thing here is this piano, which is signed by a bunch of different piano artists. This one right here, thumbprint, I was just told of Stevie Wonders. Look at them all. Every single key. These are all the people who sign the keyboard. Piano, I should say. This is basically where we were yesterday. The chocolate emporium is just there. Which is cool, but now we're up, like literally outside the John Lennon room. And this has to be the coolest thing ever. This is nuts. Oh, I shouldn't be here. <laughs> How did we get here? That's the question. And like, look at all this. Bananas is this. My God. I'm so excited. I can even see, well, I can't see it in the video probably, but over there is like Harry Potter land. And apparently some people are lining up already, so I'm not going to go too close to the entrance, but I'm absolutely blown away. I'm so incredibly giddy about all this stuff. Like, how often do you get to come and do shit like this? It's so bizarre. I love it. Orlando? You're all right, Orlando. This is the classic hard rock area. There's all the musicians stuff everywhere. I'm like geeking out right now. There's so many stuff from different people here. Like King, John Lee Hooker, Roy Orbison, Johnny Cash's guitar. Awesome. But she just showed us a really cool thing, which is a really rare Beatles thing. Where's this poster right here? And as you can see, it's not a Beatles poster, it's Rory Storm, and the Beatles were opening for him. So this is even like a Beatles headlining thing, it's them opening for somebody else. I don't know how many of you care about this stuff, but I think it is freaking awesome. We have a pair of Buddy Holly sunglasses, or regular glasses actually, they're not sunglasses. We got Baby Angels, Fast Domino, that's pretty cool, I'm that's the view is awesome too. And there's even more stuff around in here. We even have an Elvis room here. It's one of his uh, suits, and here's his, uh, his training uniform. <laughs> the coolest thing ever. It's apparently the largest hard rock in the world, which I didn't know. Because I, I, I said that it was the coolest one I'd ever been in, but I didn't know it was the biggest one. That's a badass jet jacket. I want that jacket. All right, now that that uh, tour is over, um, this bike here is apparently Bob Dylan's bike. Oh my god! <laughs> the amount of stuff that's in here that is just absolutely priceless, and the amount of stuff in here that, like, this huge legacy that goes on in this place. And all these really cool things, and all these performers that have been here, and then there's the Irish YouTube guy about to do a show. It's so surreal, but it's also awesome. I can't believe I get to do a show here. I can't believe I get to be here at all, in any regard, doing what I do. But to be here in a place with such legacy to it and with such cool shit in it is, it gets you, man. It's awesome. I'm so grateful, I'm so honored, I'm so flattered to be able to do something like this here. There are some people waiting outside and I did say hi to them. I said hi to a, a dabbing Jesus who offered me donuts. But there's some more posters all along here with all people who have been here. The White Stripes, Newfound Glory, Velvet Revolver, The Darkness Slash, 
Ludacris, Alicia Keys. Dude, this place is awesome. Orlando's gonna be a hard one to beat. Remember yesterday we get to go to Universal and do all that stuff, but now we got a really cool tour of an awesome venue with a bunch of history in it. So awesome. Also, Matt, our sound guy, pointed out that they're can't hear here now and I can't clap with one hand, but there's like a reflection here that when you clap, it bounces from floor to ceiling, and it's just like bang. It's really weird. Really strange. I don't think everybody cares, <laughs> except people who study sound. But it's fascinating to me. So now I'm telling you. So now you have to go out there and educate yourselves. Um, but this is a sold-out show. I'm really excited for it. Ooh, this is going to be a good one. I can feel the energy in here already. Um, there's going to be like 1,800 people in here tonight. Capacity is normally like 3,000, but um, that's with just standing if you come to see like a rock concert. But here tonight we have 1,800 people sold out. <sighs> we still might beat an Irish heart. how you can get different things in different venues, you put it on your rider, and for this one I put down novelty items from different places, so everywhere we've been getting snow globes, for some reason, even in places that don't even get snow, which I think is hilarious, but this one, in Hard Rock, we got a bunch of stuff, I got a hat, that apparently you can't actually buy anywhere, it, it's given to all the people who perform here, which I think is awesome, and it's a really nice hat anyway, it looks like a hat I normally wear, I got pins, so these are anniversary pins, because it's 25 years, and on the top one we have the old building, and on the bottom one we have the building that we are currently in, which is a new building, I also got a shirt that has the Hard Rock on it, which is really really nice, um, and I also he gave me a Harry Potter snow globe, which came in this big ass box. And now I'm gonna unbox it for you. Check out the guys on Boxing Channel. Look how pretty it is. It's the Hogwarts castle and snow inside it. Do 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 Harry Potter do 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 Dumbledore. It's nice. It's really heavy. I'm gonna beat somebody with it. So for this one, you can see the screen behind me, but this is the actual screen. There's the jams. tradition of walking the venue and our stairs. That's pretty badass looking. This is exactly what I wanted. When I saw it at first, when I saw the, the two extra screens on the side, I was like, oh, it'd be so cool if we could get them to mirror the images there. And we did it, baby. <laughs> it's so cool. Because now, normally when I'm playing, you, I, I kind of block some people's views and some people in the front can't really see, so now we have screens all around so people can see it from everywhere. Wow, look at these seats. Holy crap. If you get to sit here, you get a great comfy seat. Oh, the intro video is playing. But, oh, 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 spoilers, can't give away too much. I'm just gonna sleep here for a little bit. Oh, it's so cozy. Burn them to hand out water to people who are waiting in line. Because it's very, very warm out here today. Also, all the chairs are in now. So it's almost time. Um, but I wanted to see if we could see him handing out water to people. Because it's super warm. And they're all gonna dehydrate and get some burnt and everything, so. I'm glad that he's doing that. We have to be sneaky because they're outside of the like right there. No, they already did it. We missed it. Here they come. Those boys. Such sweethearts. Um, so I'm gonna go through this. Um, usually I post them on Instagram stories 
because I want to show people that I got their gifts. I can't get to everyone's gifts. I'm so sorry. And some of them are letters, and I can't really go through everything and show them all on Instagram stories. Number one, spam. Number two, I don't have the time because a lot of them we go through and I post them on Instagram, but then we bring them up onto the bus and then we see them afterwards. So I can't get through all of them, and we have a hard cut off tonight of midnight, and it is currently 10:38. So we have a very very short window of time to get through these. So apologies in that front and first and foremost. But let's go. Uh, uh. All done for the night. Man, that took a long time to go through all the gifts, but you guys are incredible. Seriously, thank you so, so much for all the gifts. There were so many of them. This is, this, that was the most amount of gifts anyone has given on the tour so far, and it's so super sweet of you guys to put that much effort. So many gifts have so much effort gone into them, and it's incredible. The fact that you come out and spend your night with me at all, but that you brought such sweet gifts is really, really nice. But um, we gotta take off. We, like, severely are running out of time. We have to leave in, like, 20, 30 minutes, which normally we have a bunch of times to just hang back. So, yeah, let's call it 4 a.m. This is, like, not midnight. We're out. So, I'm gonna leave this vlog here. Orlando, you're gonna be a hard place to be. That was one hell of a night, and I'm so incredibly happy with how things are going. Um, I think we're, like, halfway through the tour now, so. We got the showdown, we know the format, everything's running super well, and I can't wait to show it off to the rest of the tour, so thanks! I'm gonna leave this here! Bye guys! See you tomorrow! Random Jack's Crazy Adventures! Wow!